Hi guys and welcome back to Enigma 77 Reviews. Firstly, I need to apologise for the loudness you may hear in the background. I'm hoping that you don't hear it. It's dreadful. <laughs> it's dreadful. I know you can't be helped. It's locked down. Everybody's in the garden. It's a nice day and I prefer to film in the day while um, it's, I say it's quieter, but it's not quieter, but I like to film in the day because at night time, I'd like to render and edit when it is actually quiet and I can concentrate. So there's lots of DIY, there's lots of kids screaming, there's lots of adults effing and jeffing. It is what it is. Okay, guys, let's get on with today's video. So I'm so excited. So I know what this parcel is. And the only reason I know it is because I'm very observant and I do my homework. So every time I do a small independent business, I tend to either ask them some information or I will go on their about, or I will just put two and two together. Um, sorry guys, my glasses, about that person in general. Plus I get to know that person um, over a period of time, either before I buy from them or generally after I buy from them. In this case, Debbie came to me and she contacted me. I will hold my hands up. I hadn't no I didn't know much about this company. And I think it's because it doesn't turn up on the alternative market. She actually does the um the other market. Is it the art artisan market? It's another market that she does. I think it's that market's completely different in the genre. I'm not too sure, but I didn't come up with Debbie. But when she come, when she came to me and I went onto her page, ah, I was blown away. And I'm, I'm very observant. And the first thing I noticed was a profile picture and I was scratching my head and I was like, I know that beautiful face. <laughs> I know that face. So I kind of messaged Debbie and I said, is that Shelby Toms on your profile picture? <laughs> Or is it just somebody who looks just like her? And she said, yeah, it's Shelby Toms. Now, Shelby Toms was last year's um, alternative modelling contest winner. And she's lovely. She really is lovely. When she did her q and I actually went on there and I did ask her a few questions about the competition. Because I've got my anxieties about the competition, I am slowly getting used to the fact that I'm going to be doing it. I, I spoke to Shelby and um, it's mad to see that she's actually a customer of Debbie's. So I was like, I'm going to have a look at what Debbie does. And I, I had a look at her items and oh my God, stunning. Absolutely stunning. I mean, I'm not really into like steampunk kind of thing, but I will never like judge the fact that what she does for that genre is amazing. So she did ask me if I wanted to review some of her items and I was client like really, really honoured. And I think she's seen me through um, DMC Designs because I think she's friends with Danita. So I was really honoured and I, I kind of said, can I have a look and I'll get back to you. So I did have a look and I thought maybe this is the, the small independent business that I can get my jewellery from for my competition because it has that kind of look that I want to go for. So I did contact her. Now, one of the items is not here at the minute. I haven't purchased it yet, but because of the lockdown, she can't get to the actual shop where it's being displayed. <coughs> Excuse me. So she will grab that once things kind of calm down and she can get to it. And then I will purchase it and she will send it me. And that other item is part of my competition. But one of the items, the main items, is in here. And I'm super excited to get in it. So if you're wondering who I'm on about, I am on about Alternative Finch. Now, what do I know about Alternative Finch? Now, there wasn't a lot on her about, and I was like, eh, eh, I'll have to ask her a few questions. But I kind of just put two and two together, what type of person Debbie is. I know she's a metal head. She absolutely loves metal. But I know that she's been um, trading for about 10 years. She deals with kind of, she makes kind of like chokers, um, steampunk, a lot of steampunk. She also um, does hair accessories as well, you know, like the sliding clips. And it's amazing what she does with them. She also does cameos and that's why I, I, I spotted cameos. She does beautiful cameos and she does make a lot of her own um, jewellery through metal binding, you know, binding around her jewels and stuff like that. She also does boho, rockabilly. Guys, the list is long. I've actually wrote some things down that she actually does phone cases, iPad cases, Kindle cases. She's always open, so you can message her at any time to contact her. And she also does commission orders as well, which she did say to me, if you want to commission orders, she could do that. 
I fell in love with, with three of her pieces straight off just looking at them. So I knew that I was quite happy with just getting them. Now she does a lot of um, like bird skull kind of things and she's told me endless amounts of what kind of skulls they are. My brain's just like, yeah, too many, too many. So alternative finch, the finch comes from her surname and I like the way she's done that. It's, a, it's got a real nice ring to it. So guys, she has sent me this parcel. Uh, my address is at the front, but I'm gonna crack it open and let's see what she's put in there. Now, she um, she wanted to either give me a percentage off or she wanted me to pick a gift. I was quite happy to just have a bit of a surprise and just told her just to do whatever. I'm easy, I'm easily pleased guys, believe it or not. And you've probably figured that out about me. She's well packaged this up guys. So what I might do is just go off camera, open it and then we'll start from there. Cause you don't want to see it for 10 minutes while I'm opening it. So back in a jiffy. Okay guys, Debbie, you owe me a thumbnail. <laughs> trying to get into that it took me five minutes to get into that guys and <laughs> boom my thumbnail pinged off so we're minusing a nail until i glue it back on and she really did secure the parcel that with with that really sticky tape right guys so i've cracked it open this is what it looks like inside i'm just gonna hand in hand in dive in <gasps> oh my god okay box empty Right, there is a beautiful displayed box here. I love this. I love everything about this. Green! <laughs> I think she knows that I like the certain colours. She knows I like red, purple and green. And I do like blue as well. Black, obviously. Um, but that is a beautiful display box. So I'm going to save that to last. And I'm going to dive into this one. And it says, Happy Post. It sure is for a Saturday. It's actually Saturday today, guys. I was feeling very, very down yesterday. I had some news that one of my um, friends had passed away that I used to work with. And although we've not seen each other for a while, I still got a little bit choked up about it. And I um, we, we spent many laughs at work together. So I am very fond of the memories. So I was a bit down in the dumps yesterday and Debbie did ask if my parcel come. But it was it was Friday and it was Bank Holiday Friday so there was no post. But here today and I will message you in a minute and say it's here. So let's get cracking open. Green tissue paper. I can see. I can see what it is. Oh my God. Okay, so she's bubble wrapped it very securely. Oh my God. I love what she does guys the cameos that she does i'm gonna i'm gonna insert some pictures guys as we talk so you get to see and i will put some pictures up at the end so you get to see the kind of things that she does now today she's reopened her etsy shop um she's had it closed for a little while just because she's been um adding new pictures making new jewelry and because of the lockdown and everything um because debbie actually does still work so um I, I don't think this is her main like job i think this is a side part Strike me if I'm wrong, Debbie. Um, but um, she's reopened it today. So I will link everything down below. Facebook page, Etsy page, Instagram page. Anything that she's got, I will link down below. But um, oh my God, guys, wait till you see this. This is absolutely stunning. Now, as soon as I spotted these, I was like, oh my God. So guys, <gasps> look at that. So if you're probably wondering why I'm wearing red and black, I have purposely done that for today's video, simply because I knew these pieces were gonna be in here. And I am actually displaying my um, Gothic Hats headdress. Um, as you can see, I keep, I always keep Nala, the Nala headdress guys. So it kind of goes with the theme. So this headdress is for my alternative um, competition. I will be taking this to the competition with me. I probably will decide if I'm gonna wear this with the other piece or one or the other. But guys, just, just take that in. How stunning is that cameo? I've got a thing about red and black together. I just think it's aesthetically pleasing. Um, I'm not artistic in any shape or form, but I am a bit OCD with certain colours and I just, I love black and red together. I love Heavy Metal Mama's hair. I just wish I could have that again. I did used to have my hair like lilies, but it, I couldn't cope with it. it. It was just breaking away in my hair. But stunning, Debbie. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Now, 
I will pop the price up above here so you get to see how much this was. I'm not quite sure now how much it was. I can't quite remember. It might have been £16. I might be wrong. I've actually got my RAF mail on at the minute, guys. But let me just... That was so easy to put on that. And I mean really easy. So, guys... <gasps> That is stunning. So I'm actually wearing my Spiral Direct red and black top as well. So I'm trying to contrast the red and black theme. That is stunning. And it's quite a heavy piece, guys. It's not no light piece of jewellery. It's super heavy. And because it's heavy, it really does sit nicely on the neck bone. <gasps> I love it. <laughs> I keep going. <laughs> I think this is around, because you did ask me what length chain I went. I think this is maybe an 18-inch chain or maybe a 16-inch. I'm not quite sure. I didn't actually look back at my order to see. But I like this kind of length because it's in shot of the camera and I just like the way it just sits there. <gasps> this would look so nice with a roll neck top as well. A beautiful red top, black, black and red contrast together. I love it. Debbie, thank you so, so much. The chain is beautiful as well. The detail, it's all like the filigree here and it's got this, I keep saying black spinel, but it might not be. It's just a black gem. In between, I'm really sorry about the noise, guys. I absolutely love this. And then the rose is actually, there's a word for this. Oh, is that a little, oh my God, like a little rose is growing out of that rose. It's like, if you look at the side there, it's raised. Oh, I love it. I love it. So that is my first piece, guys. I will insert a picture of my other choker that I will be getting from Debbie. And so you get to see, I'm going to put that up now so you get to see what that is. Can you see the details in that chalker? I just think it's absolutely stunning. And it's different. I like different. And the fact that it's an, an octopus on there, I don't care. I've got an octopus blooming brooch that I absolutely love. So she's put it in this blue organza bag. As you know, I like to collect these organza bags and I've not had a blue one, so I will keep that. Right, guys. <gasps> the Vista Resistance. <laughs> Let's go for this one. I may have to take this necklace off to try this on, or I may put both. I'm going to have like neck full of jewelry here. Let me just turn and take Raph Mails off for a second because I really don't want it getting tangled up with that one and snapping. This too is a, a lobster class. So that is that on its own, guys. So you can get to see what it looks like on its own. So let's crack this one open. She has so taped the sides. Oh my God. So take that out yes cards before i crack that one open guys we'll see that one there oh she's put me in a few cards i'm so glad she did that because i'm going to the alternative competition as you know and i did say to her if you want to put some of your cards in i can hand them out at the alternative modeling contest now if anybody else small businesses wants to do that please 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 just give me a, a dm contact me if you want my address, send me your business cards. I'll get a little wallet thing because I'm going to get some done for myself. I'll put them together and I will get to hand these out on the day because everybody there is alternative. So they would like to see where all their jewellery is being bought from. Now, if somebody says to me, I really like that piece, where did you get it from? I can just turn around and say, there's a card, take it with you. So on the back, it says www.facebook.com slash alternative finch. And then it's www.etsy.com slash shop slash alternative finch. And then she's also got www.newmonday.com shop slash alternative finch. Or please email me for custom orders. And it's evil deb. <gasps> My eyesight is terrible at yahoo.co.uk. I will put all that information down below. But I'll let you just take out a look there. I like her cards. They're proper thick cardboarded cards. And then there is a picture of one of her chokers. Amazing, beautiful. So she's put me in one card, which I'll keep for myself to put on my board. And then she's put me three cards in there. Now, Debbie will probably send me some more of these. Oh, if she wants to, when I get my other choker, that's entirely up to her. But that that's there for you guys, if you do want to do that. Thank you, Debbie, for putting them extra cards in. I'll stick one on my coffin board, which I'm in the process of making. Now, I'm going to I'm gonna leave this one to last because I think this is a little freebie that she's given to me. So, I think it is anyway. And I'll save that for last. Oh, my God, guys, this looks amazing. I'm so excitable. You can call me the excitable bunny. Right, so green tissue paper. Let's just pull that back. Oh, my 
god guys this is just super amazing i'm gonna pull it out because i don't want it to drop out <gasps> oh my god my heart's going doo -doo -doo -doo. this is so beautiful <gasps> oh my god now i know why shelby toms like gets her custom pieces from there amazing debbie amazing i hope i do a proud with this review because what she does is amazing they all oh my god guys just look at that just just take that in oh, that is just stunning oh my god she has told me the skull of this i can't quite remember oh it's so it is a little i think it's a little a, i don't know if it's a bat skull or it's a bird skull it's some kind of skull guys and then she's put it on a cameo again with this filigree design around the side on a black background and then it's stuck on this beautiful lace and it's not thin lace guys it's quite a thick lace and it's got a red bat i think it's a bat skull guys and then you've got this little embroidery kind of bat that's attached to it there and then a same on the other side and then it's got the lab lobster clasp at the back with a little extender maybe about two to three inch extender in a v-shape oh guys you just know what i'm gonna do don't you you just know it right let me just see if i can just because my hair always gets stuck in my bloody necklace and i don't want it getting snapped i'd rather chop my wig than break my necklace right so we've got this piece on here you've seen what it looks like on i don't think you can wear both of these together like i originally thought guys there's definitely one or the other and i know which one's going to be worn on the day now the people that are doing this alternative contest with me which is morrigan raven um thunderella mama goth and um heavy metal mama i'm not too sure who else is doing it um but I'm, I'm oh, Marius as well, which I've made friends with recently. And I know that Shelby's there again with her daughter. Her daughter's taking part, but Shelby won't be. But I will get the chance to meet them as well. <gasps> oh, my God. Now, Shelby, you'll probably recognise this piece and know straight away where I've got it from. I'm so grateful that she's contacted me to do her review. Thank you so much, Debbie. I am so, so honoured. I'm so sorry about that noise, guys. There's just nothing I can do about it. And it's really bad. I don't know if you can hear it. I've shut all the windows. I'm stifling in here, guys. My makeup's like peeling off. Um, I'm trying to fasten it, but because I've got my nails on, I can't. So I'm just going to sit it there, guys, because I know I'm going to get my husband to fasten them for me and then go off camera. But there you go. Look how stunning that is. I'm so excited because this actually matches the Nala headdress. I think I've done really well to kind of match up my outfit. I know you're probably wondering when we're going to see the outfits. I'm not too sure if I'm going to sh I'm going to show them till after the competition, guys. But I am. So you can tighten it, guys. Okay, guys. So Ben's just fastened it for me. He's actually just said, "Oh my God, that is really, really pretty." You were you were honoured, Debbie. He's not into jewellery or anything. He never ever compliments any of my jewellery. But as soon as he said that, he said that is really nice. So there you go, guys. That is what it looks like on. I'm keeping it on for the rest of the video. So if she's got something else in there, I'll probably just show you and not take this off. It's so heavy, guys. It actually is a it's a nice heavy. It's like a, it's very like supportive choker. I love it. Now she does these all in different styles, as you've seen from the purple one. That as well is going to be. But when you see the detail in these, you can honestly. I'm not surprised she's not charging more for these, to be honest with you guys. And she's got these little pearlescent diamonds. Oh, just finishes it off. I absolutely love this, Debbie. Thank you so much. I'm so, so overwhelmed. I love it. Let me just clip back. So I've, I've clipped my hair back for a while, guys, just because it's warm in here. And you get to see this choker beautifully. So I'm just going to trim my hair. This is this piece. I'll pop up the price up here so you get to see how much this was because I know all of you are probably going to want to own one of these. <laughs> I absolutely love it. And I like the fact that she's put it in a very nice this, uh, presentation box. So when I take this off, I will keep it with the bubble wrap securely, obviously because of this little chap. Oh, just look at it, guys. It's beautiful. Right, next. So this is my... Um, extra item that she put in for me she really didn't need to do that her just coming to me 
has just made my day you know i i'd like that i have had another company that's i'm going to be doing very very soon it's not arrived yet it probably will arrive on tuesday um so i will be doing another one and that's voodoo dudes so when they come we will discuss that as well but she comes to me as well i'm just so honored that they're coming to me um it's just it makes me feel like what i'm doing is actually worthwhile and i'm doing it proper <laughs> all right guys let's crack it up and i'm so excited <laughs> This has really cheered me up today. I really need this because I'm struggling at the minute, guys. And I'm not going to talk about it because I don't talk about anything like that on my channel. But this has really brightened up my day and that's all I need to say. Ugh. Oh, my God. Oh, she's... Oh. So, it's in this organza bag. Oh, I thought she might have forgotten. I actually chose this because she asked me to cho choose something. But I chose it like way before I bought it because we discussed like getting it and then I went quiet for a bit because I wanted to get the money together for it. And then um, I just couldn't wait any longer. So I got my funds together and I said, Debbie, I'm going to get it now and I'm going to get that necklace with it as well. Because I knew I couldn't get the, the purple choker just yet, but I can't wait to get that as well. This is just... <sighs> right, so the white organza bag, it's a bit tangled. But that's fine because it's not tangled to the extreme. It's they're bound to be. Oh, guys! So she did ask me if I wanted some earrings. Now these earrings could be matched with this. So she sent me the two. So guys, just look at them. Oh, so I will be wearing these on the day that I wear this as well. I will be taking that necklace as well. So it's like I've got this. Oh god! And I've got another necklace to match this. I'm so, so stoked. Debbie, amazing. So guys, as you know, I do support these businesses the once and then I will go back to them again. What I'm trying to do is get through all of the small independent businesses that appeal to me the most. And because um, I need to get to House of Bats, I've been saying it for the longest time, but um, I will be getting to them very, very soon. I don't know, I think I like this on its own, but that's what it looks like, guys. Just just think that it, if it was on its own, and there's a little skull on that as well. <gasps> I absolutely love it. Thank you so, so much, Debbie. So that's the alternative Finch, guys. Please go over and show your support. I would really, really appreciate it. All the links are down below. I know I probably have an idea of who's going to go ahead and buy from Debbie, and I hope that they do um because these are absolutely amazing absolutely amazing now remember she does do customized um orders so if you do want something um even her accessories her clips rings bracelets anything like that or you just want something kind of kitted out like for example like this kind of thing if you can go to debbie she will she will do that on your phone case on your jewelry i love it absolutely love it i'm so made up i'm going to take some pictures now for debbie and um get that the picture will be at the end but thank you so so much to alternative finch i am so grateful so so grateful and thank you to everybody who supports small independent businesses you know these people are amazing i just love what they do i love their creativity more than anything it's amazing I couldn't do this, guys, and that. I do have a creative side when I feel like it, but I could never, ever. I just couldn't. <laughs> I just haven't got the patience. All right, guys, take care of yourself. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you want to see when I upload. It is usually, guys, Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday, but sometimes I'm throwing in a few bonus ones. I do marathon film, so... If I do look like I'm wearing the same stuff day in, day out, I'm not. I'm just doing it all on the same day. It's it's just because I, when I have the chronic illness, sometimes I don't want to do anything. And if there's something that needs filming, do you get me? All right, guys, take care of yourself. Thank you, Alternative Finch, Debbie. Mwah. Love it, love it, love it. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Stay to the end. Have a look at the beautiful pictures. Bye for now.